KFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 57. NASDAQ is down 112. S&Ps are down 14. Gold. Gold contracts flat at 19.44 an ounce. You get silver down 22 cents, $23.28 an ounce. Light sweet crude off 61 cents. $86.93 a barrel, notes and bonds. You get the 10 year note up nine ticks, trading 109.31. The 30 year is up four ticks at 119.10 in King Dollar. King Dollar is up 194 ticks, trading out at 105.054. The euro is at 106. The yen's trading out here at 147. The British pound is at 124 to 1 US dollar. We well, go, let's go right to the spy because what you're going to have here, folks, you're going to have a rejection of lower price. You're going to have lighter volume in, in a monster way, too. So you're going into. Let's put this up. You're going into the strength that has 83 million, and you've only done 43 million. And this is a spy, and you've already rejected 442.75. So this market's not done trying to get higher. You go into the, we take a look at the that's that's on the spy. We take a look at the actual contract, the future contract. Let's see where we're at with the future contract. So you're coming up to the highs right now. You don't have a high volume high, so it's going to be interesting here the next uh, 10 minutes. Because what you did do is that you get a little expansion here, but nothing heavy. But it's going to be easy to take this out because you only have 17,100 at the high of today. That's how this is shaken out. We get into the Qs. Now, this is amazing, actually, that the Qs also a rejection lower price with lighter volume, particularly because you got Apple that's getting smoked with volume. So you had the Qs reject 369, you're 372, you're coming into 56 million, and you've only done 39. You're at 369, well, the 369 was out there, it was the low of the day, and the bottom line right now, you're at 372. So that's pretty intense when the, when the aspect of, you know, where Apple is, because Apple basically is coming down with volume. Now, let's go over the dollar, because the dollar is teetering over the 104.699. And the 104.699 is the number you got to keep your eye on. And I suspect it's going to fail. The reason I'm saying I suspect that it's going to fail, because gold is up 10 cents. Gold should have been smoked here as it was went over it. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Sharpening your skills.